This ship is what China needs to transform its navy from a small fleet into a formidable force capable of gaining dominance in the Pacific. The Chinese Defense Ministry announced in December 2015 the plan to domestically construct a new Liaoning aircraft carrier. Less than two years later, the country's first home-built aircraft carrier is about to enter the water. China's first domestically built aircraft carrier is near the final stages of construction. The giant ship, which is now at Dalian Shipyard, has also been painted in PLA navy grey, meaning it is almost ready for launch. I am excited to see the first aircraft carrier made by ourselves. It gives a great boost to our military development. I've seen some photos on the internet before. Today I brought the binoculars with me and it looks magnificent in reality. In the shipbuilding industry, measuring tides and currents is an essential part for getting large ships safely into the water. Ministry enthusiasts on China's social media are predicting the new aircraft carrier may enter the sea later this week when the next astronomical tide occurs at the port of Dalian. While the ship may appear complete, it is yet to be fitted out internally. Equipment such as radios and radars, even kitchen appliances, still need to be installed. Analysts believe it will take about one to two years for the new aircraft carrier to carry out functional debugging of devices, weapons and equipment before the craft can begin sea trials by early 2019. Guanyang, CGTN, Dalian.